Welcome back and good morning 714 and new this morning local Girl Scouts have taken a big bite out of their cookie oversupply thanks to your help and the community's help. I see what you did there but <laughs> they still have a long way to go in selling mm. some 168,000 boxes of cookies. That's a lot of cookies. That's a lot. Fox 35 Sydney Cannon is live in Orlando at the warehouse that's storing those cookies and Sid the Girl Scouts of Citrus Council is starting to donate cookies now to local charities because donations are pouring in. Good morning. Good morning. Every little bit helps Danielle and Ryan. Just take a look. They still have a lot of cookies to sell 168,000 boxes. But as you can see, they have taken a big chunk out of their cookie oversupply. This area was actually filled with cookie pallets two months ago. But as you can see, the Girl Scouts still have a long way to go. In just two months, these unsold Girl Scout cookies have dwindled from this to this. The Girl Scouts of Citrus Council sold 12,000 cases after asking for the community's help. And the community has responded just so overwhelmingly. Um, we've got, you know, individuals calling and requesting cookies for their, their home, their businesses. The pandemic significantly affected cookie sales and Girl Scouts of Citrus COO Crystal Jones says they're still trying to sell 168,000 boxes of cookies. But since the call to action, $90,000 has been donated to its Care to Share program. Allowing the Girl Scouts to load up cookies and donate them to local charities. Second Harvest Food Bank, um, the military, I mean, we are we're trying to really explore and, and we're open to any organization that we can support. Give Kids the World Village in Kissimmee just received 12,000 boxes of cookies. I think what this last year has shown is that when we work together, we're stronger. And I think it's something really special when two charities in the same community are partnering together. And Girl Scouts are still getting creative to bring the cookies to the community. We went to an event called Villacon at a convention center. We've never done one of those before. I think we ended up selling around 313 boxes of cookies, which is really good. All right, so we still have 14,000 cases of cookies to sell. The Girl Scouts saying they hope the community will continue to support them because that's how they have gotten this far. Of course, if you're interested in helping out the Girl Scouts, we have a link on our website, fox35orlando.com. Reporting live in Orlando, Sydney Cameron, Fox 35 News.